Hey guys, how to in here, and in this video I will be showing you how you can make your Android device look like this cool launcher. So if you want to learn how to do that, then just watch this video. Be reviewing this cool little launcher that makes your Android device look like a beast basically it's called full screen launcher there's a free version there's a full version as usual and before I start this video by reviewing it and showing you how to get it on your device um, I want to tell you guys that I finally got an HD camcorder it only records up to 720 not 180 because they ran out so but maybe in the future I'll probably get a better camera but right now I'm pretty happy with this camera so far it looks great and yeah that's pretty, pretty cool about it so back to the video um, basically what you got here is when you scroll through as you can see there's it's like a 3d animation you could pinch out and when you pinch out it doesn't show you screens there's no screens at all it's just one big screen that you, that goes on and on forever I mean literally goes on and on forever and it never stops too because I just put an Android um, market over there and it won't stop moving you also got that with your Android apps which pretty much looks the same um, but you gotta wait a while so to open up your apps because sometimes you won't be able to see them all, all at once so you have to wait like at least 10 seconds but other than that you can see all your apps within a swipe like literally a swipe it's actually pretty cool and as you can see at the bottom if I go to the bottom you can see like a little you can see like the reflection of all the Android apps and all the Android widgets that I have on my home screen and on my Android apps if I could zoom out you see I could zoom out right there too you could basically zoom out on everything and also you may be wondering what that 3D cube is that's your folder that's your average folder looks pretty cool it looks like your Android home screen basically which people say you could add widgets on it but when I press tap on it tap widgets tap something no widgets at all I guess they gotta fix that cuz it just goes to cuz it just goes to your home screen but it's pretty fluent it's pretty smooth so let's see let's make a new app the new folder let's call it how to men and I'll press OK and look I got a new um, I got a new folder doesn't really look like a folder it looks like a 3d cube it looks pretty cool because it never stops moving and let's just put a random application the calculator and when you're about to put something down it's gonna tell you what it's gonna look like it's gonna yeah so pretty cool and if I drop it in there it's going to be in my folder so that's actually something pretty cool also down here you guys the dock um, you can't really change anything on the dock um, you can't put apps you can't change um, the phone and the browser to anything so let's say I want to put this right here you actually can't and um, I just think that's pretty bad because you have all this space down here like you could put like at least four wait for apps down there for a shortcut but you know it's not it's not it's not the best but it's pretty cool I actually pretty like it because um, it's pretty fluent it has all this animations plus when you open up an application let's say I want to open up all my files you can see a cool little animation when you when you open it up as you can see it zoomed out let's try another one let's try on my calculator calculator it zooms in pretty cool and it opens apps like really fast so downloads pretty cool yeah so it works on every single app that you open um, and it's actually pretty smooth 
there is a full version and there is um, a free version. Right now I got the free version um, because I don't really think you should pay for the full version because all it does is take away this ad and I know this ad is really starting to piss me off because you can't really see most of your applications up here but the cool thing is that you could zoom out and you could ignore it like literally <laughs> and and besides, I made another video on how to get rid of ads, so I haven't really done that yet because I got it. I just got a new room, so yeah. But I will be getting rid of the ad soon. So yeah, it looks pretty cool, and it also does that with your contacts too. If you open up your contacts, you can see all your contacts, and if it has a picture for your contacts, it shows you the picture. For example, I think I have one of a person. Right there, I, yeah, it shows you an icon picture, um, person named Facundo, and uh, that guy's pretty cool. And if you scroll through, you can see all your contacts. Right now I have um, quite a lot of contacts, I think. Why do I have so many contacts? But orientation right now looks fine, and it actually looks pretty, pretty smooth and pretty beast. But um, sometimes there's going to be uh, closes, like pretty much a lot of closes and it's gonna foreclose on you a lot anyway um so yeah there's a free version there's a full version so the free version is in the android market and the full version is an in-app payment so you can't really um hack it it's called full screen launcher it's by christoph not nys i believe and um so go install it guys it's free called full screen launcher like I said before and yeah that's my video for today yeah so I'm um, thank you guys for watching this tutorial I will be making more videos in the future to come and if you have any questions on this app then go tell me in the comments below and I will answer your question um, anyway rate this video a thumbs up please subscribe to Altuman thank you for making us a thousand subscribers and I am so happy a thousand subscribers, that's so much guys, that's a lot, that's a lot. Thanks, I really love you guys. And hopefully soon we'll make um, another hundred another hundred subscribers. Um, but anyway than that, um, I hope you guys have a good day. And go check out the app, it's pretty cool. Hope it works for your phone, because I, I think it only works for 2.2 or higher, but if it works for um, 2.1 and lower, then if it works for yours, then go install it. It's pretty cool. And yeah, that's all I got. That's all I got pretty much to say. So, see ya. Kapow.